So let's have a look at how this clueless construct could work. So here I've got an idea called prompt matcher. And what it's going to do is take an input file. In this case, it's going to be the diff CSV. From there, we want to find a pattern. So the pattern, I'm going to call it issues. And I've just started writing it, analyze the following diff and identify the pattern below. So I've listed what the old and the new code should look like. And then I've said, if it finds it, return hash shorthand syntax. After that, if it's not found, return no match. And I want to make sure that it doesn't try to return any other sorts of information. From there, just insert the actual content that you want it to compare from. And what we'll do is we'll also print out a report. And when we look at that, we can see this report has come through. It's got the different match types, including no match. And then it's got a column of how many are for each type. And then we've got a scattering of hash syntax, shorthand matches throughout all the other files. Now, if we look at how many changes could happen, we've got this column B, which has the things that we want to change. And we look through and there's hundreds of files. This is a lot of changes that are going to go on. So we now need to wrap this up and bundle it into specific prompts that we can use in cursor.